Hey everyone, Neil deGrasse Tyson here, and today we're digging deep, not into space, but into the fascinating world of geoarchaeology. You see, understanding our past is just as crucial as exploring the cosmos. It's about piecing together the story of humanity, our planet, and the forces that have shaped us. Now, for researchers toiling away in the trenches, literally getting their findings out there is critical. So we're about to uncover the top platforms where these modern-day explorers share their groundbreaking discoveries. Get ready to unearth the secrets of the past. We're kicking things off with a heavyweight contender, the Journal of Archaeological Science, specifically their national editions. Think of these editions as specialised branches, each focusing on a particular country or region. Now, why is this a big deal for geoarchaeologists? Well, it's all about targeted exposure. Imagine you've unearthed a fascinating artifact in Egypt. Publishing in the Egyptian edition of the Journal of Archaeological Science puts your research directly in front of the leading experts in that specific geographic area. It's like giving a TED talk to a room full of people who are already passionate about your exact topic. This focused approach increases the chances of your work being seen, cited and sparking collaborations with fellow researchers in your field. It's about building a community of knowledge, one national edition at a time. So if you're looking to make a splash in a particular region, remember the power of these specialized journals. They're a gold mine for, for targeted impact. Next up, we're venturing into the realm of national societies. These organizations are like the gatekeepers of knowledge for specific disciplines, and they often have their own publications, journals, and even online platforms. Now, you might be thinking, Neil, why should I care about these niche publications? Well, my friends, it's all about tapping into a network of experts who live and breathe your field. National societies are hubs for regional expertise. They connect you with archaeologists and geologists who have dedicated their careers to studying a particular area. Publishing in their journals or presenting at their conferences is like getting a stamp of approval from the leading authorities in your region. It's a fantastic way to gain recognition, build credibility and forge valuable connections. Remember, science thrives on collaboration. National societies provide that vital link to a community of like-minded individuals who can help you push the boundaries of knowledge. Now let's talk about the unsung heroes of academic publishing university-based journals and repositories. These platforms are often overlooked, but they play a crucial role in nurturing the next generation of researchers. Think of them as incubators for fresh ideas and emerging talent. University journals often have a more specific focus, catering to a particular niche within geoarchaeology. This can be incredibly beneficial for researchers who are just starting out. It allows them to publish their work in a supportive environment and gain valuable feedback from experienced editors and reviewers. Repositories, on the other hand, are like digital archives where researchers can deposit their data, publications and even presentations. This not only ensures the long-term preservation of their work, but also makes it easily accessible to a wider audience. So whether you're a seasoned scholar or a budding geoarchaeologist, don't underestimate the power of university-based platforms. They're vital for fostering growth and innovation within the field. Hold on tight, because we're about to blast off into the stratosphere of scientific recognition. National Science and Research Councils are like the NASA of the research world. They fund groundbreaking projects, support scientific endeavours and provide platforms for researchers to showcase their work on a national stage. These councils often have their own journals, online portals and even dedicated funding opportunities for geoarchaeological research. Getting your work featured on these platforms is like receiving a Nobel Prize in the world of science. It instantly elevates your profile, attracts attention from potential collaborators, and opens doors to exciting new research avenues. So if you're looking to make a major impact and secure funding for your next big dig, keep your eyes peeled for opportunities offered by your National Science and Research Council. They hold the keys to unlocking a universe of possibilities for your research. In today's interconnected world, collaboration is key, and when it comes to connecting researchers across borders, ResearchGate reigns supreme. This online platform is like the Facebook for scientists, but instead of sharing cat videos, they're discussing groundbreaking discoveries and exchanging ideas. 
For geo-archaeologists, ResearchGate is a gold mine. It allows you to connect with colleagues from around the globe, share your publications, ask questions and engage in stimulating discussions. It's like attending a never-ending virtual conference where you can rub shoulders with the brightest minds in your field. But ResearchGate is more than just a social network. It also boasts powerful tools for tracking the impact of your research. You can see who's citing your work, download statistics on your publications, and even receive personalized recommendations for relevant research articles. So, if you're looking to expand your network and amplify the reach of your work, dive into the world of ResearchGate. In the digital age, it's not enough to simply publish your research. You need to make sure it's being seen, read and cited by your peers. That's where academia.edu comes in. This platform is like a personal dashboard for your academic achievements, allowing you to uh, track your impact and connect with a wider audience. Think of academia.edu as a centralized hub for all things related to your research. You can upload your publications, create a professional profile and follow other researchers in your field. But the real magic happens when you start exploring the platform's analytics tools. Academia.edu provides detailed insights into who's viewing your profile, downloading your publications and citing your work. It's like having a personal publicist for your research, helping you understand your audience and maximize your impact. So, if you're serious about building your academic reputation and tracking your progress, make academia.edu your go-to platform. It's the ultimate tool for showcasing your scholarly achievements. For too long, scientific knowledge has been locked behind paywalls, accessible only to those with expensive journal subscriptions. But there's a revolution brewing in the world of academic publishing, and it's called Open Access. PLOS One is at the forefront of this movement, championing a future where research is freely available to all. Now, you might be wondering, Neil, what's the catch? Well, my friends, there isn't one. PLOS One is a peer-reviewed, multidisciplinary journal that publishes high-quality research across a wide range of disciplines, including geoarchaeology. The only difference is that they believe in making knowledge accessible to everyone, regardless of their income or institutional affiliation. By publishing in PillOS One, you're not only increasing the visibility of your work, but also contributing to a more equitable and democratic system of knowledge dissemination. It's about breaking down barriers and ensuring that everyone has the opportunity to benefit from the fruits of scientific inquiry. In the world of academic publishing, Springer is a name synonymous with quality and prestige. But did you know that they also have an open access platform called Springer Open? That's right, you can now publish your groundbreaking geo-archaeological research in a Springer journal without paying any article processing charges. Springer Open offers a wide range of peer-reviewed journals covering various disciplines, including archaeology and earth sciences. Their rigorous editorial standards ensure that only the highest quality research makes it through the peer review process. By choosing Springer Open, you're not only benefiting from the prestige of the Springer brand, but also ensuring that your work reaches a global audience. Their open access policy means that anyone, anywhere in the world, can access and read your research without any financial barriers. It's a win-win situation for both authors and the scientific community as a whole. Sometimes you don't need to shout your findings from the rooftops, you need to whisper them to the right ears. That's where specialized journals like the Geoarchaeology Journal come in. This journal is the go-to source for cutting-edge research in, you guessed it, Geoarchaeology. Now you might be thinking, Neil, isn't that a bit too specific? But that's precisely the point. By focusing on a niche area, the Geoarchaeology Journal attracts a highly targeted audience of experts who are deeply invested in this particular field. Publishing in this journal is like giving a lecture at an exclusive gathering of the world's leading geoarchaeologists. Your work is guaranteed to be seen by the right people, those who are most likely to appreciate its significance and build upon your findings. So if you're looking to make a lasting impact within the specialized realm of geoarchaeology, this journal is your best bet. In the digital age, it's easy to get caught up in the world of online publications. 
But let's not forget the power of face-to-face -face interactions. Conferences and symposia provide a unique opportunity for researchers to connect, share their work and engage in lively debates. Presenting at a conference allows you to showcase your research to a live audience, answer questions in real time and receive immediate feedback from your peers. It's also a fantastic way to network with potential collaborators and mentors. Many conferences and symposia also publish proceedings, which are collections of papers presented at the event. These publications offer a valuable snapshot of the latest research and often feature cutting-edge findings that haven't yet been published in traditional journals. So, dust off your best presentation skills and get ready to share your passion for geoarchaeology with the world. So there you have it, our whirlwind tour of the top platforms for publishing geoarchaeology research. From national editions of prestigious journals to specialized online repositories, there's a perfect platform out there for every researcher and every discovery. Remember, the key is to think strategically about your target audience, your research goals, and the impact you want to make. The beauty of geoarchaeology is that it's a constantly evolving field. New technologies, methodologies and theoretical frameworks are constantly emerging, pushing the boundaries of what we know about our past. And as our understanding of the past deepens, so too does our understanding of the present and the future. So keep exploring, keep questioning and keep sharing your discoveries with the world because the more we learn about where we've been, the better equipped we'll be to navigate where we're going. Keep those shovels sharp and I'll see you in the next dig.